Hello Cancer, this is your mid-month for February 14th through the 28th. Happy Valentine's Day, you guys. Love you guys, okay? Let's see. If you guys are new, welcome to the channel. Please hit the like button, share the video, and subscribe. All right, here we go. Know how we get down with this Celtic. All right, guys, let's see what's going on with Cancer. What's going on around Cancer? And what is challenging Cancer this month? Oh, uh, okay. So I have, I'm going to do this. I'm going to pull this card out because it flipped over. And I'm going to put this other one back. All right, so we're going to do that. What's crossing or challenging you? And then let's see what the underlying issue is here. What was going on in a recent past? Best possible outcome here. What's coming in for you guys? How do you guys feel about this situation? And the influence here. Your hopes your fears and the overall okay what's going on around you is the four of pentacles holding on to something here i feel but in holding on to something um you guys are kind of being a little closed off Okay, and so your challenge for the remainder of the month is to open up, to extend yourself, to not get out of character. Okay, because I feel that cancers are very loving people. Um, it is not to let something or someone change who you are innately. Okay, so let's see what was going on in the past. Let's see. Oh gosh, yeah, I see why. I see why you're you're very closed off. Capricorn individual strong here that is, that a lot of you guys have been dealing with, but um, there's something here that was was very toxic for you. Something you felt very chained to, and you still kind of feel chained to it. It's hard for you to let go of whatever happened between the two of you. Okay. Um, but I think the way for you to protect yourself right now is for you to not extend yourself like that. I'm never going to do that again. You know, that sort of, um, you know, that point of view. I'm never going to be this way with anyone else. No, do not let this, this situation, this individual change who you are. That is what your challenge is because you're naturally loving, naturally giving. It's just knowing who to lend your energy to. Okay, so that is what the challenge is for you guys. Let's see what the how you view this situation here. You're tired. You're tired. Okay. And you feel like you've been through a battle here. And you're not sure whether or not um, you can actually move past this is what I'm getting. Because it's like you, you're still you're still very present in this situation. Still very present. But you don't like it. And so the only the only way for you to kind of like um, shut it out is almost like to shut down. And um, that's where you guys are. I, I feel like you've just been through a battle here. The underlying issue is that this person hurt you. They hurt you badly. And I feel like, um, you know, they probably rejected you. They probably did not reciprocate the way that you felt, um, the things that you did for them, how you extended to them, how you, you know, extended your energy to them, cared for them. They did not reciprocate that. They weren't there for you through thick and thin as you were for them. So, yeah. The best possible outcome is here is that you will end this. You will let this end, okay? Whatever it is that you've been holding on to that you are afraid of, um, letting go, you'll end it. You'll change. You'll transform your energy into this right here once again. Okay? You'll change this energy right here. And you'll turn around 
and still be your your good looking cancer selves okay that's what is the best possible outcome is here you'll end this nonsense with this individual and keep it moving what's coming in for you guys is just that the knight of cups you guys are going forward going towards things that you feel are good for you okay and you're not letting anything stop you i see this coming in for you this energy turning around because right now this is what you're doing right now this is what you're doing looking back at the past but this was coming this is you coming in okay now the influence here is moving away moving away not extending yourself communicating with other people being bothered with other people who vibe with you that are on the same playing field as you and moving away from this energy leaving it alone that's what you guys are doing look at this moving away from it because you know this is this is not this is not a good energy to be in right here that's not but I see you guys progressing and leaving that behind towards going towards the end of the month here. Okay. Your hopes is that you'll no longer be waiting around. I don't know how this card came in reverse, but it did. <clears throat> but you're no longer waiting. You're no longer investing here. Okay. Not giving this situation any more of your precious time nor energy. Your fears is to be trapped in your own thoughts being stuck not able to move as you are right here trapped in your own head i don't see that happening though so don't worry okay <laughs> overall outcome is a four of wands you finding your stability and happiness okay doing those things that that um you're excited about um feeling I feel I'm feeling this level of comfort of solidarity I feel like this is exactly what's coming in for you guys as soon as you move away this is what you're going towards solidarity possibly a new relationship for you guys maybe some of you are even communicating with someone else currently okay but still kind of holding on to a past situation that was like eh, eh, eh. All right, so let's pull some clarity for you guys. Let's see what this devil energy is about. Why is a devil here for cancer? Why is a devil here for cancer? I'm going to pull this one. Hmm. Somebody was hiding something, keeping secrets from you. Maybe even their feelings, okay? I feel like this person probably was a mama's boy. Um, yeah, anywho. Okay, one more card for the devil. Queen of Cups. Now, if you notice that in this Queen of Cups, this person, this person is like they're they're being kind of uh, okay because she's looking straight ahead, but she's extending the cup the other way. It's like this person was never all in. Okay, that maybe they were lending their energy somewhere else. They never quite, you know, they weren't transparent with you. You kind of, they were fickle. You really didn't know how they felt about you. You really didn't. <clears throat> and again, I feel like some of you <clears throat> had mama's boys. Okay, very attached. Um, so they couldn't be all in with you because most of your energy was like right there or wanted to be petted up by you but not extending as much to you as they were expecting you to extend to them is the thing okay <clears throat> and probably lending their energy other places too because their attention is not like on one thing is is what this is <clears throat> excuse me sorry guys i want to see what this four of wands oh okay what is this Four of Wands here for? Why is the Four of Wands here? The Four of Wands. The Six of Cups. Soulmate Energy. Reuniting. And the Knight of Swords. Hmm. Somebody's wanting to come back, tell you some truth. Um, they're hesitant about it though because mm, this Knight is on foot. 
So he's not coming in fast or she's not coming in fast. And the sword is down. Okay. So I feel like this person that's coming back in um, wants to talk to you about getting back together, whoever this is. But um, be careful that they are revealing um, everything to you that, that you want to hear or that you need to hear even. Okay. But definitely want to talk about... Um, tell you some truth it may not be the whole truth though okay so we have uh, Gemini Libra Aquarius Scorpio Aries here Taurus Sagittarius <clears throat> excuse me Capricorn um, maybe Pisces is here as well okay all right guys so that's what I have for you and I will be speaking with you guys soon